Hi, painting. Happy Wednesday or whatever day you are viewing this, if you are viewing this. Um, all right, I'm going to just continue on with my pair. This is my third session uh, with this painting. The first one was the underpainting. Yesterday was what I have here. And um, will this be my last session? Je ne sais pas. I do not know. So um, I'll continue to work through this. I might pause this and keep working as opposed to working and narrating. Um, but I'll stitch that, all that together. All right, so I'm gonna get into some of, what am I gonna get into? I don't know. I think I'm gonna get into um, this orangey right here. Uh, this might be a little bit too bright. I can still see where I wrote medium under there. So um, I'm gonna try to work with some thicker uh, paint right here. And to neutralize my orange, this orange uh, straight out of the bottle, SOTB straight out of the bottle is um, pretty bright. So I gotta knock that down. I'm gonna knock that down with some blue. A little bit yellowish down here. There's this little moment of yellow right here that I want to keep. So I got to make sure not to paint over that. That little bit of blue knocked that down. Maybe a little bit too much. Add some white on it. See, it's just gonna make it all chalky. White makes colors lighter, but not brighter. gonna get rid of that hue that's in there that orange hue Too blue, which means too green. If you're using a lot of phthalo blue in your composite or in your pear painting, you might see that that phthalo gets, once it gets in a painting, it gets like in your paint. down here. <clears throat> I'm gonna let that dry a little bit. Get into my um, 
negative space. What I discovered yesterday about this negative space, that that phthalo blue and white makes a really amazing bright turquoise like this. But that really isn't bad. White's just gonna make it lighter. It's gonna maintain that um, bluey. So I'm gonna knock that back. And some orange. I love this edge right here. It's still a little bit too dark. Okay, there's a little bit yellowish over here. I don't want to blend it too much because it's not necessarily green. Almost there, I think. Am I? This highlight is too highlighty. It's not that bright.
All right, I'm gonna stop here. A, because I've got a class coming in. And B, um, I wanna let this dry, so. Um, hooray.